guys and welcome to Florida. Yeah. Hi guys and welcome to Florida Day 13. I'm here. Well, I'm not here. My own mobile is in the Nike outlet behind me. So I just thought I would intro the vlog and put myself today. I'm going to pop into the Nike store and show you some things they have in there and just so you can get a feel of what's in the outlet. So we are in Vineland outlets today. So these are different to the ones we were in last time. They were the premium um, outlets. These are the premium Vineland ones. So they're opposite side of International Drive. In the Nike store, I was out here just chilling on a bench waiting for him. So he's going to show me what he got. So he got two pairs of runners. So he got these spotty black ones. <laughs> and then the spotty white ones. And then he's also wearing a pair in the nude. So he has three pairs. No, he actually has four. He has a navy and blue pair back in the room. <laughs> so that's your haul. Do you want to show us what you got in Under Armour as well? Well, just whatever you got. You got a drink. A water flask. Excellent. A cute hat. Fab. They, everything in Under Armour was an additional 40% off the price tag, so um, what was it, like $100 for all this stuff? Not even, it was like $90. $90 for wow. all this stuff. And then you got t-shirts, like, shorts. oh shorts. Fab. Very nice. And I just got a white, a white t-shirt. And, and a black one. And a black one. Yeah. How much were the runners? Um, I can't remember. Did you get a bargain? 79 I think. Each? Oh, 60, 69 each. Okay. Yeah. So they were 140 all together for both? Well, tax. 160. One, 149. And then well, 150 and then tax. 160 with tax, so yeah. that's good for them. Pretty good, yeah. Popping into the night store and I'm just going to show you quickly what they have because I'm not shopping because I'm already broke. <laughs> So this is $24.99, so these are like training tops are $24.99 and then you take an additional 30% off. So most stuff is like a price and then it's an additional percentage off the lowest price, which is so good. So the shorts are the same, they're 30% off. These are 25 as well. So you get the gist with all the the shorts and tops and stuff like that. Then they have loads of like training, sports bras. Be nice. So these are all in around $29.99, $24.99. And then again, it's an additional 30% off. I'm gonna show you the runners. So these are the runners that they have here and I'm just gonna show you like the price range. So these ones are 55. These ones are so nice. Um, and then these are the orange ones, they're 55 as well. So they have a fab uh, range of runners in store for like relatively cheap. How cute are these like pinky purple ones? They're so nice. So there's so many different ones. You just have to walk around, find your size and yeah. There's some shirts here. These ones are an additional 50% off. So these ones are $20 and then another 50% off. So they work out at like $10, which is so good. Crazy, crazy prices. How much is this one? This one is 21. So yeah, these are like $10. They have like hoodies and crop tops and stuff like that. I'm not gonna show you everything obviously because there is a lot because these are really big like outlet stores. Um, but they do have a lot of cute stuff. And um, they're $40 and then they have the Nike leggings as well and then look how cute these shorts are, they're so cute, they're such cute colours. I love these. Show you some of the shops that they have, so they have Polo, Ralph Lauren, they actually have a Clarks here, um, sunglasses, Hulk, Paul. <laughs> Uh, what else do they have? They have a Skechers there. They have um, a Clarence factory outlet as well. I haven't actually been in there. I don't wear Clarence, but just for anyone who does. There's a second Under Armour. Um, this one is just footwear though, so it's just runners and stuff like that. Socks and things. Watches inside Citizens. They're so cute. 
Oh my god, look at that gold one. They're so nice and that's all black. Adidas store here, Paul's going in there for a bit of shopping. They have like an Elizabeth Arden over there. Elizabeth Arden company store and the outlet there as well. I just ventured into the Adidas store because it started raining, it's a bit stormier. So I just thought I'd come in and show you. So everything is half price, so half off of the lowest mark price on the um, tag. So this tag is 65, so that means that is 3350. No, 3250. I'm not so good at quick math. <laughs> 3250. So yeah, so these are like what, $10? Because they're half off of 20. So that was the men's, so I'll just show you the women's, so that's a women's one, but obviously you can just wear the men's hoodies and jumpers because I always steal Paul's jumpers and stuff like that and then like that one's, um, that one's 75 and then half price of that. I'm just bored wandering around because <laughs> I'm not shopping. Um, this is my outfit today, this is from Nasty Gal, um, just like a little tropical face suit because it's so hot out and yeah. Have loads of like sports bras and things like that so some of those are marked 20 so they're half price so they're only like $10 and that one's 25 so that's 12.50 that was good quick math um, and then they have like hoodies and more hoodies like that one's 55 as well so everything's kind of like the jumper wise and the um, kind of tracks the bottoms are like 50 55 so they're all like 25 dollars sports bags like this one is 35 dollars so then obviously half price of that again that one is 45 it's a bit of a nicer color these like leggings here these ones are 20 these ones are 29 and these ones are 35 and then again obviously half price off so it actually shows you here um what the price is and then what you actually pay and um, so yeah half price Guys, I'm just in the uh, cosmetics company store and I just thought that I would show you again some of the bits that they have so all the Becca range obviously they have all the skin perfecting finishers then they have all the different highlighters here so these are all priced at 38 and um, the blushes are 34 and these are 41 um, but then once you spend over $100 you get 50% off um, they have the ultimate coverage 24 hour foundation in all the colors as well and they have loads of the Bobbi Brown um, long wear weightless foundation they have the BB creams they have tinted moisturizer intensive skin serum and then there's more Becca here so there's Becca lipsticks and concealers and then they have the Chrissy Teigen set here which is so cute and there's more sets down here so the vacation glow it's only 26 and um, these two primers are only 20 then there's this one here which is 35 there's another one here Tom Ford and it's like 60% off all these palettes and blushes they've loads of MAC eyeshadow as well here and it's 75% off and um, all of these different products which is lot so definitely be sure to pop into this store all the Clinique range as well they have like the cleansers and like they have the sets and stuff as well and yeah again like once you spend a hundred everything is 50% off which is amazing or if you don't spend a hundred it's 40% off it's eye hydration they have loads of like Tom Ford lipsticks Smashbox here lipsticks Tom Ford perfume here as well We've just popped into Tommy Hilfiger again. I think it's 40% pretty much off everything. This is 50% off. So all the percentages are different just depending on what you're looking for. 
denim jackets and hoodies so it's pretty similar to the outlet that we were in the other day there are some different bits and pieces but it's pretty much the exact same they have really nice gym gear and this one and this one um, is all half price these are really really cute I really like these and then they have like the kind of rain jackets here as well they're really nice too the pink and they're 40% off where we are we've come to the cheesecake factory oh uh, yeah it's just a little while later and we have come to Cheesecake Factory. The Cheesecake Factory out in the mall, uh, mall of Millennia or Mall at Millennia. I'm not sure exactly what it's called. And we have a buzzer because we have to wait 40 minutes for a table because it's so busy. Um, it's about 8 p.m. now, so it's kind of packed in there, but it's okay. I don't mind. Food cheesecake. Because I'm so excited. I'm a cheesecake. Paul's not as excited as I am. <laughs> Guys, we've just been given some menus and I'm just going to show you a few bits of what they have because the menu is quite extensive, isn't it, Bob? There is so much on it. So we're going to skip the drinks. Um, so these are the small plates of snacks. So these are not even the apps. The appetizers are here. We're not even sure what we're having because it's taken us so long to actually just get through the menu there's like two pages of like appetizers and then there's like six pages of actual food so they have glam burgers which are hang burgers and then they've got like asian inspired dishes and they've italian and then they've like tacos and there is just so much but i think i want um pizza because I'm really clean. Oh. What? We're buzzing! We're buzzing! Ooh. So we're just in waiting on our table. Our buzzer got called. I'm very excited for a cheesecake. Oh, cheesecake. Oh, let me show you some cheesecake. All oh, the cheesecake. Guys, I just wanted to show you some of the cheesecakes in the fridge. Oh, it looks so good. You can't see the middle. The drinks have arrived. I went for a frozen Aperol spritz and it looks so good. And Paul went for water and a side of margarita. <laughs> a side of Mark. Yum! So, guys, I'm waiting for it to focus. And we have some more. It's not focusing. So, guys, we went for the cheeseburger spring roll bite. And then we went for like mini mozzarella sticks to start. Ooh, we're so excited to try them. So guys, my favorite so far has been the cheeseburger spring rolls. What about you? Um, yeah, they're pretty good. So if you're going to the Cheesecake Factory, definitely get the spring roll cheeseburger apps. They are so good. I've gone for the flatbread pizza for my main, more food and some mash, because I love mashed potatoes. And Paul's gone for the chicken pasta and it also looks delicious and he got a second cocktail because he's mad <laughs> yes you are so we have gone for the cinnamon cinnamon swirl cheesecake and it looks divine we're gonna check in and see what it tastes like perhaps we're down here at the icon park and someone gave us free tickets to ride I don't know what it's called, the Star Flyer? Star Flyer. So we have free tickets to go on this, so we're gonna do it, I think. I don't really wanna do it, but Paul does, so. We're ready to go! <laughs> I'm the Star Flyer, and I'm terrified already. <laughs> What's that big brain blob? <laughs> Oh 
I don't mind roller coasters because like you're you get so dizzy like you, you're yeah you get dizzy around. and like a sticky we've only had dinner so my belly is a bit sick <laughs> I don't mind a roller coaster because you're like strapped in like really secure but that's just like a little seat belt and a little piece little, of little piece of metal <laughs> it's a little swing that you're like I think it's 400 feet in the air or something um yeah and like I couldn't look up, I was like, I don't know how far away I am from the top, but I'm not gonna look because I'm so scared. And then I wanted to know if you were coming down, and I was like, I can't tell because I can't look up because I don't want to know how far away I am. Yeah, it was terrifying. I think like, only because we had free tickets. Yeah, we got it for free, so. We don't it's so fun. I mean, if you're into swings and heights, then do it. If you're not, maybe skip it. <laughs> So Paul has decided we're going on the train here so in the Icon Park. I always want to do this in the, the pavilions. <laughs> <laughs> you know, we're going around the pavilions. So. so guys, we are just on board the little train. <laughs> this is hilarious. What are you like, Paul? now after our last night in Orlando and um, we're going to pack our cases because we haven't packed yet we've checked in an extra case because we have a few bits to bring home or Paul has no you've way more than me let's be honest 
um, so we've checked in an extra bag it was $80 so if you're stuck or you're worried about your luggage being overweight I would just check in another bag because the sake of $80 if your case is overweight it's at least $100 each so you're better off checking in your case just to be certain then you get an extra 23 kilo as well so which is pretty good um, so we are just going to end the vlog here, Paul, and we're going to say goodnight and good night. say thanks so much for watching and make sure to like and subscribe if you're liking the video so far and like good our time here in Orlando. And we will be back again. Yeah. We have to do um, our tips, top tips. Yeah, we're going to do our top tips tomorrow. Well, we're going to cover our travel day home as well tomorrow anyways. Yeah. So, and then we're going to do top tips and I'm going to film um, my... Orlando proof makeup vlog as well because people seem to be very interested in the makeup and how it stays on so well um, And a few other things that we have to share but for now Good night. Good night <laughs> And we'll see you in the next one